What's up, y'all? Hey, guys. We're Embrace the Suck 21. Yes, we are. I'm Spencer. And I'm Daniel. Y'all have been asking for this for a very long, long time, and we're finally time. getting to it. It's Little Britain. We get requests to do a lot of shows, and a lot of times there are things that need context, yeah. and we've asked around, and... The general consensus is that we could get away with this one with just a compilation. So, right. this compilation is celebrating Little Britain. Cool. Along with material from the original series, has skits from other series, Come Fly With Me, Little Britain USA, and Rock Profile. So All right. That's what we got in store. Let's do it. Three, two, one. <laughs> what? Britain is a democracy where any citizen can become Prime Minister. Today, the Prime Minister, Michael Stevens, is proving very popular in the polls. Morning, Prime Minister. Good morning, Sebastian. You know my wife, don't you? Hello. Hi. <laughs> Maybe I should just go? No, 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 no. Please sit down. Actually, we have something to tell you. I'd like you to issue a, a press statement confirming that Sarah is pregnant. What? I'm three months gone and well, bumps beginning to show. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> so is that it or is there something important you need to discuss? Oh. <laughs> well, I, I thought it would be quite a big story this morning and I'd like you to handle it. Oh, Chief Whip, excuse me. So it's definitely his, is it? Oh, wow. and Florence are transvestites. Uh, <laughs> I write in. Oh, I man. Right in. Just getting right into it. <laughs> <laughs> like, I wasn't ready for that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and when are they from? The Victorian era? Yeah. Like, what? Transvestites. What is that? Oh, God. Uh, it's... <laughs> oh, my God. It makes me think of the little bit in uh, Shooting Stars that we... We found and where <laughs> Matt Lucas as George Dawes came out as you know lesbians, lesbians. Yes. You yes. remember that one? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So. Oh my God. Uh huh. Best times. Now let me do the talking. <laughs> oh, aren't these ladies' dresses delightful, my lady friend? Yes, Emily. Oh, this one's very you, I think. Oh. Hello. Can I help you, ladies? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, I, I'm getting married, <laughs> and I would like to purchase a dress, please. He has a full oh, mustache. No. <laughs> what? Oh. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, my God. Oh, that's awesome. It's it's this guy to show. It's, it's going to uh, be this guy to show. All right. Oh. For me, I am a lady. <laughs> Oh, yes. Yeah, and we require a bridesmaid's dress for my young lady friend here, Florence. Yes, I'm ever so excited. I've never been a bridesmaid before. I'm only 15, you see. That's one homie looking 15 year old right yeah, there. With a full mustache. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. It's some mustache, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Men. Hello. <laughs> Hello, Dan. I brought you a can of pop. Oh, that's very kind of you. <laughs> now, I've had a call from the people at Birdseye. Is there a fly in here? Yes, don't worry, it won't hurt you. Oh! <laughs> what? Oh, wow! <laughs> Ignore it, it'll fly away. <laughs> oh dear. Very hot today, isn't it? Well, why don't you try this? <laughs> what is this? I'm gonna have a great God. What it... is this? You know, the only only place I recognize the other dude from is Britain's Got Talent. I okay. think it's Britain's Got Talent. That's the only other place. He's one of the old co-anchors, co-panelists, uh, judges. Thank you, judges. So that's the only way. That's the only place I know this other guy's face. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Sorry. 
It's fine. Oh! I'm going to have a great time at Brownie Camp, Ellie Grace. But I'm really going to miss you, Mom, because I love you so much. I love you too, Ellie Grace. I love you more than gummy bears. I love you more than puppy dogs. I love you more than smiles. I love you more than raindrops. I love you more than transsexual porn. <laughs> Ellie Grace, where did you hear that? Julia's older brother said he saw some on the internet. Oh, did he then? This mommy on a site called chickswithdicks.com. Hey, everyone on board now, please. You better get on the bus before it leaves, Ellie Grace. Huh? <laughs> I love you more than kittens. I love you more than roses. I love you more than cotton candy. I love you more than blowjobs! <laughs> oh, oh God, oh God, oh buddy. <sighs> That's just the, the, the faces right here in the background. Are just saying it all. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> It's five past Alberto, and at Fat Fighters, the meeting is just beginning. Yeah, I know, well, they're all the same. Anyway, listen, I better go. I've got my fat people here. <laughs> Welcome to Fat Fighters. Our buzzword for today is... Cravings. What foods do we get cravings of? Tanya, start us off. Chocolate. Chocolate. Yes. Well done, chocolate. Okay. Mary. <laughs> Fish and chips. Sorry, do it again. Fish and chips. Do it again. Fish and chips. Uh, must be some sort of dish that we don't get over here. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God, I guess. Oh, that's right up there with, I hear you're a racist now, Father Ted. <laughs> <laughs> God, oh, oh no! Uh, British humor, man, it's just different. It just hits <sighs> differently. <laughs> oh man! As Mr. Ernest and Duque, and Blue and Andy are on their way home from the shops. Yeah, you look very well. Yeah, yeah, done. No, not really. Oh, what? come on! You look lovely. Yeah, yeah you. really nice like thank that. You. I'll see you later. You take care. Yeah. Bye. What? This patio is going to look lovely. You're going to be able to sit out here in the summer and thumb bay. No, no. Right. <laughs> Nearly finished. I want to go on it now. Oh, no. You can't go on it now. It's got to dry first. No, no. Oh. Ow. Oh, me back. Oh. Ah. I think something went there. <laughs> oh, come on. The day as well, you know, and I carried you to the top of post office town. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! Oh. Ow, yes. It's right. It's fine. Oh, yes. Ah, that's got it. Who's <laughs> that? A bird. A bird! <laughs> Welcome to Sun Searchers. My name is Carol. Hi, Carol. Would you like a Sun Searchers lolly? Yes, please. I haven't got an A. <laughs> I hate them all. What? Little fat puffer Daffy Thomas has finally found a vocation in life. Evening, Daffy. Yeah, I'm gay. Get with the program. Have another Bacardi and Coke, please, my van will. Coming right, sir. Oh, I wish there were more things for gay people to do around you. It's so lonely being the only gay in the village. That's a very skimpy little number you're wearing there. Hmm, it's for my new job. Oh, yes. Yes, I have become a rent boy. <laughs> a rent boy? That's right, my family. I've got the looks, I've got the body, I'm a young gay guy, why shouldn't I just go for it? <laughs> Excuse me. Are you Scott? Oh, um, yes. <laughs> Not quite what I expected, but I've had an hard day. How much for a good hard shack? <laughs> my family! I'm, I'm serving Mr. Jenkins. Look, I only hold hands on a first date. Bloody time waster. I think we better get me another Bacardi and Coke, please, my family. Scott. 
just over there. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, I'm cringing. Don't, ad- don't advertise unless you're about to sell. Yeah. <laughs> you know? <laughs> oh, man. Oh. oh, God. I mean, if he wants stuff to do in Britain as a gay man... Your visit's coming to this country this year. Come on. <laughs> I get to say that I'm yeah, doing yeah, a Euro yeah. deep dive. This is true. So, you are. You yeah, are. Yeah. You Licks are. above Daniel's face. Yeah. <laughs> oh. It's a little bit chilly today, isn't it, Mr. Doggy? Oh, yes, Mommy. Mommy needs to buy Mr. Doggy a little doggy coat to keep Mr. Doggy nice and warm. Oh, yes, Mommy, that would be wonderful. I love you <laughs> so terrifying. Much. And I love you too, Mr. Doggy. Take off your clothes. What? me? I said, take off your clothes. <laughs> no, Mr. Doggy, it's cold, and you're not allowed to take your clothes off in public or to take you away and lock you up. I said, take them off. Now, listen, Mr. Doggy. Mommy's had quite enough of your silly ideas. You're gonna get Mommy into trouble. Uh, what? Take him off. No! If you love me, you do it. Oh. oh. Well, um. Don't do it. Very quickly then. <laughs> what in the world? Oh! <laughs> this is awfully embarrassing. <laughs> What's so yeah, Why did you it? Know? No. Go and stand in the trash. Certainly not! I won't tell you again. What is this? And why? I have so many more questions. I have so many questions. Why are they here? And why are those people in the background eating something? And, like, why is... What is going on? Because I know they're in the U.S. Yeah, yeah. You can tell from the license plates. Yeah, and and the and the side of the road in the road. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so what? From so the last questions. thing that we checked out that had our friend Matt Lucas in it, you described it like this: it's a mixture of what the fuck and what the fuck. Yeah, that's mixed with what the fuck. <laughs> This is all I'm asking. Yeah. Just a simple question. Yeah. Oh my god. <sighs> <laughs> oh my god. What the actual what fight? You Why on earth would anyone want you to do that? Lady, you're out of your fucking mind. <laughs> Get out of the trash, please. Come on, lady. <laughs> Oh, my dog! I'm not with her. She is one crazy bitch. <laughs> what? Oh my god. In darkly noon, Aspo enthusiast Vicky Pollard has left half her kids at home as she begins her first day at work. Right, wait there. It'll just be a few hours. <laughs> They're giving me baby evils. <laughs> oh, that'll be the babysitter. Okay. You must be Victoria. New but, yeah but, new but, yeah but, new because I'm too late like the babysitter or something a fan. Come in, you're a little late. They could give me evils. What happened was, was I was going to be here about half an hour ago, but I couldn't because we was all at McDonald's. Because Jay Maguire really fancies this bloke who works there called Lee Cherry, who used to go to our school and he's done like the best out of everyone in his year. Archie's already in bed, he should be fine. If he wakes up, don't let him watch cartoons. Yes, he'll settle better if you read him a book. A what? <laughs> I hope you don't mind me asking, but have you looked after children much before? Oh my god, I still can't believe you just said that! Shut up! I'm like, well good with kids, because once me and Carrie Delaney was at the Broadmead Centre, and she had one of them babies where you don't even know you're pregnant till it comes out. She had it in the middle of the top shop, it was well graphic. And oh yeah, and I've actually like shut out six kids myself, so does that count, super bitch? <laughs> Keep the change. Uh, somebody oh. tell me what accent there, uh, that that Matt Lucas is trying to impersonate here. No, it was like Morse code. I was like, <laughs> what? It took me a long. It took me way too long to get that accent. <laughs> way too long. I know there has to be some sort of specific 
place that yes. they're trying to yes. impersonate here. So let us know, please. <sighs> I'm not familiar with that accent, though, so far in our journey. No? No, not that accent. Yeah, maybe it's just an exaggerated <laughs> thing. Yeah. Probably is. It, it, it's that kind of show. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, no yawning from you. Nice and over yet. <laughs> 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 or maybe it is. Becky! What are you doing here? You ain't even bite ads. Where's Archie? Is he alright? Yeah, we sent him down the office to get some more facts. What? Think it gives me evil. <laughs> ID. Anyway, I am actually quite busy at the moment trying to get off with this bloke. Actually, if you don't mind, actually. Get out! Get out of my house! Don't worry, we're going. This party's like well sad anyway. <laughs> and I found your poor nose, you dirty bastard. Oh! Oh yeah, and I can do next Tuesday if you want. <laughs> I just wondered if you know what the deadline is for the Sylvia Plath essay. Oh. Aren't her poems wonderful? She always seems a bit down in the dumps, though. Sorry, I just need to know when the deadline is. I'm not sure. Martin will know. <laughs> Martin, it's Linda. I've got Molly Spencer here. Wants to know when the Plath essay is due in. Molly, you know Molly. Lovely brown hair. Quite petite. Almost very pretty. <laughs> Looks like she's balancing a Malteser on her face. <laughs> when you see her, you want to go, careful, there's a bee on you. And then you realise. That's right. Molly the Mole. <laughs> <laughs> it's Thursday. That's the problem, is it? Yeah, and there aren't any copies of the female eunuch left in the library, so I can't really write the essay. Oh, well, uh, I've got a copy here. Great. But that's mine. I don't want to lend it out. <laughs> Martin may have one in his office. Oh, God, OK. There we go. Martin, it's Linda. Got a student here, wants to know if he can borrow your copy of the female eunuch. Steve. <laughs> you know Steve. He's got a beard, quite tall. It looks like he's just stepped out of the shower. <laughs> Carmen Miranda without the fruit. Oh my god. That's right, Ali Bongo. <laughs> oh, no. oh my god. Oh. There's no way the show is on now. Can't no. be. No. No. <laughs> oh, God. So this is another type of show. Yeah. Come fly with me, right? Yeah, yeah. I think that's what it said in the okay. description. Yeah. Whew. All right. But it was going to be a quiet day anyway. We only had two passengers booked into first class, and the passengers in question have just cancelled, which is a dreadful shame. Hi, Penny, did you get the message? Yeah, such a pity they cancelled. No, 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 no. The message about helping us out in economy? Piss off. <laughs> Penny hasn't had to work in economy for 20 years, but today she has no choice. <laughs> <laughs> when you draw back. <laughs> she, Penny knew what was up before 2020. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> curtain uh, the first thing that really hits you is the stench and it's the stench of the working man i mean they're virtually like apes you know <laughs> so if you if you come at them with some food <laughs> they start attacking you look at you what a cutie he's just three months oh he's beautiful can i hold him for a bit oh, there, if you'd like. yeah yeah <laughs> oh look at you eh who's a handsome wee fella Look at you, eh? <laughs> I just need to put him in the overhead locker. Oh! <laughs> Madam, I told you before, turn that phone off, please. This hell's spotting Trump. The matter. <laughs> it's like the oh. last episode of the Gervais show where Carl was like, oh, if you just throw a baby, <laughs> throw, throw a cat. baby down out the window, like, no! No, no, don't, don't do that! that. Don't, don't do that! that. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> is keen to have a word with one of the guests. Mrs. DeVere. Call me bubbles. Everybody does. Uh, word. Do you mind if we walk and talk, darling? I have an algae wrap at three. Yeah, it's really just about this payment situation. You've been with us for over five months now. We still haven't received anything. Oh, that's terrible, terrible, darling. It's outrageous. Has my husband still not sent the check? 
No, I'm afraid not. We can't seem to track him down. Have I tried him on the Monte Carlo number, darling? No, I don't have it. Have I got a pen, darling? Um, yeah. The number is hmm? one two three four five six seven eight nine. Okay, darling. <laughs> Mrs. Devere. Hello, Gita. My turn now, darling. Oh, oh my God. Oh, sorry, darling. See you at dinner. Sebastian, would you lock the door? <laughs> Come over here, please. I have something rather private that I need to show you. Yes? Something uh, quite sensitive. <laughs> it could be potentially very explosive. Oh, Prime Minister, I want it so bad. <laughs> it's this file. Oh, yes, this file, yes! <laughs> 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 Is that everything? Yes. <laughs> Do you want to get up? No. Well, my dear Emily, it is to be your final night as a single lady. That's right, Florence, my lady friend. But I'm getting married in the morning to a man. Well, it would be being a lady. So I suppose if any man should wish to take advantage of me on my one final night of freedom, they should speak up now. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't care why she's dressed. Why he's dressed like that. Like, like, just out of the Victorian era. Like, <laughs> what in the world? I, I love that. Because just it's British humor. So... It's just Little Britain. Right out of left field. <clears throat> oh, oh, my God. <sighs> Love it. <sighs> <laughs> well, it's still early. Who's that it? Yeah, I'm gay. Get over it. <laughs> there we go. This library now has its own gay and lesbian, including bisexual section. Well, actually, David, I don't know whether you've ever been past travel, but we do have quite a popular gay section. What? Come with me. <laughs> what the hell is... Shh! <laughs> <laughs> Are you excited about your first sleepover, Ellie Grace? Oh, yes, Mommy, but in a way I'll be sad too, because I'm going to miss you heaps. I do love you, Ellie Grace. I love you too, Mom. I love you more than teddy bears. I love you more than teddy bears, too. Mm -hmm. I love you more than sugar kisses. I love you more than Dumbo. I love you more than pink blossom. I love you more than... I love you more than... Have I got you beat, Ellie Grace? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love you more than double-headed dildos. <laughs> Grace, how many times must I tell you, you are not to mention such rude things? Sorry, Mommy. Especially not in front of the twins and their mama. I will never have you over again. Yes, Mommy. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, hey, guys, welcome. The girls are just out playing in the yard. Jenny! Jesse! Thank you so much for having her. I'll pick her up tomorrow at 9 for her ballet class. Great, we'll see you then. Hello, Mrs. Say. Hello, Ellie Grace. Hello, twins. Hey, girls, don't you look pretty? <laughs> now be good, Ellie Grace, and remember what I told you. <laughs> Okay, bye, Mom. I love you more than bunny rabbits. No, we're not playing that game. <laughs> it's so cute. I love you more than bunny rabbits. I love you more than cheesecake. I love you more than Santa Claus. I love you more than birthdays. I love you more than homemade cookies. I love you more than anal beads. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> Like oh. mother, like daughter. Yep. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what is this? By the way, how would you <sighs> rate their American accents? Oh, uh, passable. Ah, uh, little not, exaggerated. Not around here. Not around here. No. They could no. pass for uh, a northerner in the south. Yeah, yeah. A, a transplant from, yeah. from upstate New York. I didn't, was that a pun? <laughs> I had to. <laughs> <laughs>
I had to. But no. <laughs> you asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I had to. I had, anyway, I had to. I mean, my God, it's in the vein of this fucking show. Um, <laughs> they could pass as a northerner in the south. Uh, yeah, yeah. Because they don't know what we what we sound like. Right, right. At all. Uh, no, no. <laughs> <sighs> I hate you. I know. <laughs> I was uh, watching this film last night, Captain Corelli's Mandolin, and I was really wanting to visit the island of Kefalonia where they filmed it. Excuse me. Computer says no. <laughs> if you're a film fan, I can take you where they film Midnight Express. <laughs> no, thank you. I got a two for one deal on a canoeing trip where they film Deliverance. No, thank you. So, so pass on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I was trying to... No. Isn't that Sean's mom in Shaun of the Dead? Maybe. I think it is. Maybe. It I looks think... like a very young version. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I had to get that in there. Yeah. Good good eye, yeah. I think. I try. I try. Thank you. Says here the locals are very friendly. <laughs> Thank you. Can you put your hands over your mouth when you cough, please? That's disgusting. <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> I'd like a round-the-world cruise, please. Leaving in March, returning in September, uh, travelling first class for about £700. <laughs> Computer says yes. OK. <laughs> Last week, I asked you all to bring in a picture of yourself not looking at your best to act as an incentive next time you're reaching for that slice of cake. We like cake, though, don't we? We like a bit of cake, don't we? Yeah, I like cake. Give me cake! Give me cake! A <laughs> box of cake! Right. So, let's have a look at these pictures. Paul, can you dim the lights, please? Oh, yeah, and no, I don't want to wear any rustling. This is not an excuse to eat. Let's have a look at the first photo, then. Oh! Where was this? New York. Oh. Did you pick out when you were there? You know what it's like when you're on holiday. <laughs> yeah, well, that's why you're here, Paul. Because you cannot control your binge eating. Oh. Oh. Excuse me for a moment, fat fighters. <laughs> what is that? Oh, a fish. Okay, okay. Did that to uh, blow my nose. And now, because it's only fair, here's a picture of me not looking at my best. Lost a bit of weight since then, obviously. Oh, wow. Awesome. Wow. The, the fact that she had Photoshop back then is quite <laughs> impressive. Very realistic. Yeah, yeah, and the, whoever this character is, the fat fighter, personifies every celebrity that Let has me. gone, done a Nutrisystem commercial, oh lost weight, God. and then gained it back. I'm looking at you, Larry the Cable Guy. Oh, my God, dude. <laughs> I love how I say fight, fat fighters. Like, that's... <laughs> So violent. <laughs> so violent. Like you're going to take a big yeah. thing of butter and go... Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. I love that, though. God almighty. I love it. <sighs> okay, it's like... That's on. I have a statement I would like to read. Last week, I purchased a new camera. And whilst in my office in the House of Commons, I accidentally took a picture of myself naked. <laughs> that picture somehow, and I would love to know how... Found its way onto Gaydar, which I later discovered to be a dating website for sodomites. Basically, you pay a flat fee, post your stats online, and then... I was then invited to join a group of gentlemen at a party in Brighton, where I was planning to give a talk about education reforms. However, shortly after my arrival, my clothes accidentally fell off. <laughs> At that moment, I slipped on a glacé cherry and landed inside one of the men. It's two hours into the flight to Florida. So, 
So this dude found its way onto the whatever the equivalent was of grinder yeah. back then. And, and got uh, caught. And got <laughs> caught. Got caught. <laughs> Remember and, when these used to be a thing? Sorry, Spence. No, I'll let you finish. No, 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 no. no. I was just going to say, like, if you, you went to Brighton after that, we've learned that's basically Britain, Britain's uh, San Francisco. Yep. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> no, I just, I, I remember when a lot of these started coming out at one time, like in the early 90s. Yeah. A lot of these, like, these, like a pot, like. You had the issue of public apology, right? For, right for things, and, yeah, and and yeah, not so much anymore, right? Because we realize that okay, those in that community yeah. are human fucking beings. Yeah, yeah. But it's just interesting. It's just interesting that yeah, I'm, I I I know what they're poking fun at. Yeah, maybe yeah. not specific. I don't know if this is meant to be someone, but <laughs> probably. Yeah, yeah. I've learned that you know British humor, you know. Is not depicting them as to insult them. No. It's to you know say that it's you know it's it's funny to poke fun at it. It's like you're cool. It, 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 you're cool if we're making fun of you. Yep. The opposite of American humor, which if that would be taken as Ooh. an insult. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. There you go. And landed inside one of the men. <laughs> It's two hours into the flight to Florida, and Penny is struggling to come to terms with her new environment. Oh, don't touch me! The oh noise. The people. There's only one word to describe them. Savages. Ladies and people of cattle class, may I have your attention? <laughs> cattle please? class! I have just returned from an inspection of the onboard convenience, and one of you has left it in a revolting state. Who didn't flush? Come on. It was someone who had the mushroom risotto. Hands up if you had the mushroom risotto. <laughs> this whole frightful situation would never occur in first class. People in first class don't forget to flush. They're very diligent flushers. And if they do, it doesn't matter, because their stools are perfectly formed and odor-free. <laughs> what are you doing on our patch, you tell? So they poop rainbows, is yep. what they're saying in, in, in the upper classes. Yep. Yep. <laughs> their shit doesn't stink. Yeah, their shit don't stink. <laughs> we both know our shit stinks. Yep. That's why that's why we are who we are, man. Yeah, and that's probably why you stick around for this. <laughs> yes. Yep. <laughs> because their stools are perfectly formed and odor free. What are you doing on our pots, you little bunch of ming and dog bitches? to say that would be me in that scenario <laughs> up until the yeah, nipple grab up until that <laughs> you would uh, need me to have like four other dudes uh, just help me break dance and just pull me around <laughs> like that doing it in dance off uh, like oh i love that oh my god <laughs> Just, uh, just uh, get this. <laughs> I'm now joined by the voices of Abba, Agneta, and Frida. Uh, how does it feel to be Icon? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, man. I hope no one from my Eurovision dive is <laughs> watching this right now. You gotta clip this part. Yeah, yeah. This is going on SJ Music right here. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Yeah. Oh man. I don't really like it. No. I'm talking. No, I'm really not too keen. It seems that every time I'm turning on a the television, there's somebody dressed as me. I like it when they do me. Yes, yeah, so we'll probably see some black queen dressed as you and think it is you. 
kind of flattering, though. Ooh, for you, I'm sure it is. These guys often look a lot better in your clothes than you ever did. You alternated between being the lead vocalist. Did that ever cause any confusion? No, I was the lead vocalist in ABBA. I mean, don't get me wrong, Fred here, Freedom. whatever, was the backing vocalist. But I don't think anyone ever saw her as a full-time member of the group. They did. No, you were just there as window dressing around me at the star, and it worked. Do you think there's any chance of an ABBA reunion? No, I'm really a very private person. After ABBA split, I retired from public life. I'm really very camera shy. Well, you certainly made up for that today. How about you, Freedom? Any plans? Well, I'm currently working on a new album, Hot Cheese and Firewood. The world holds its breath. Hot <laughs> cheese and firewood. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. Not only are my Eurovision people going to hate this <laughs> clip, but <laughs> there are people in the audience that, if you get this reference, you're nasty. Matt Lucas, he doesn't look like ABBA, he looks like Natasha Crown. Oh my god, all right. <laughs> Jesus. If you know, you know. And if you get that reference, you have to leave a like on the video. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> At least we can piss off everyone. Exactly. <laughs> the world holds us. out of ten, but uh, do you perhaps have the, the slightest crush on me? <laughs> Why the can you that idea? No, no, no. I, I, I just wanted to say well done. Oh, well, thank you, thank you. <laughs> well done. Well, that clears up go. that rumor. There you go. <laughs> this was oh, hilarious. This was awesome. Like. <laughs> I still don't know what I watched. <laughs> I don't know. I, I know it was a lot of cringe on my part. And <sighs> so our, our good friend Kev's uh, pointed that out. Is yes. that I, I'm cringing and you're laughing your ass <laughs> that's off. That's how I cringe as I laugh. Yeah, yeah. And oh I go, my mm, God. Like that. And <laughs> yeah. any, any, anything that y'all like, oh, he's fake laughing. That's, oh. that's my defense mechanism oh against cringe. Oh, man. Either way, automatic two yeah, thumbs up for fun. this one. Um, I... Keep keep it coming. Keep yeah. it coming. Is this? Yeah. Okay. I can get I can get behind this this yeah. show. Yeah. yeah. Because yeah. I mean, remember, I I grew up with like things like Chappelle Show. Yeah. And stuff like that with heavy South skit, Park. heavy skit based shows. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I don't need a, the the train of thought, the context as much. Yeah. Or it's rip off Mind of Mencia. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So talk about that nonsense. But no. Yeah. No. <laughs> We've yeah. already pissed enough people off here. <laughs> yeah. This was this was good. I'm 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 intrigued. <laughs> Me too. Let's, like I said, keep it coming, y'all. Yeah. Thanks for liking, commenting, subscribing, hit the bell, and share with your friends. Definitely, guys. Wash your hands, scrub your toes, wipe your ass, blow your nose, embrace the suck. Unplug and do something fun. Like this? Yeah. See you next time. <laughs> Later. Fellas, we could be that mistake. Let's do this.